Oh, oh, oh. What's up everybody, Derek here and welcome to the creek. And this is an interesting creek because this is actually a creek intersection. It's like an overpass of sorts of creeks. Up there on top is actually a bridge made for a dammed up part of the river to flow downstream. So back in the old days when you couldn't um, do a water well and you couldn't go down hole and get water to come to the surface, you would dam up a certain part of the river and then make canals to where it would flow down to you to wherever you were at. And that's exactly what that is. So I got a creek down here and a creek up there. So I'm gonna go down through here and see if we can't catch some fish. And it, there's a little hole right back in there. It's got some fish. So we're gonna start there and go all down through here and see if we can't catch some bass or bluegill or you know, whatever's in these creeks. So let's get to fishing. All right, we're gonna get started with this Helgramite. I've got a 1 16th ounce jig head on here, and these things just kind of float down really slowly, and this is my last one, but these things can catch multiple fish. The plastic on these is awesome, but there's tons of minnows down in here, and we're gonna hit up this little spot right over here, but I don't wanna get too close to it and spook these fish. So I'm gonna stay over here in the shadows, and there might be some bass in there. I see some bluegill and other, oh yeah, I see a bass in there. Oh, bad cast. Let's see if we can get one. Oh, bass hit it right away. Oh, the bass had it. Little bitty bass. Man, there are so many fish over there. Oh, there he is. He's right there. That's what we have, a little bluegill. Cool. Oh! Nailed him. Little bluegill nailed it. Oh, that's a pretty bluegill. Man, look at the colors in that thing. Look at the oranges. Whoa, 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 buddy. Pretty bluegill, man. Bunch of little fish down in here. If we had worms, we'd probably tear it up in this little hole. Probably catch every single fish in here. Oh! That's probably the biggest bass in this hole. <laughs> he nailed it. Right up under that limb. Chunky little dude. Thanks, buddy. It's like a jungle down in here. Let's try it again. Oh, there's a big old bluegill. Got him. Came out from under that ledge. Not a huge one, but that was cool. For this little creek. That was a good sized little bluegill. Thanks, buddy. All right, we're stirring a little mud right there, so let's see if it might get them a little active here. I don't know if it will or not. Mmm, bass came out of there. There's a couple bass down in that little stump. There's a drainage right here. We can walk right down here. This is where that bridge that creek's going under, so maybe we can fish this over to the river. Oh, we got something. Little bass. Let's see, that's a Guadalupe bass. Yeah. These are good, some good fighting suckers. Man, those are so cool. It's almost, they're almost like smallmouth in a way. Thanks, bud. Let's see if we can catch another one. Get it out there as far as I can. Ooh, that wind's picking up. Oh, that feels so good being down here in the bottom. Ooh, it's hot. Oh, 
Oh, oh, that was a good one. Oh my gosh. That was a real good one. Dang it. Maybe it'll hit again. I don't know. God. All right, I came to the other side of this tree right here. I was fishing over there. See if there are any fish that might be hanging out right here. Such a good spot. There's a bunch of big chunk rock down there. There's got to be some fish. We're, oh, there was... Got one. Right there. There's a bunch of chunk rock right there. This is another Guadalupe bass. Ah! Well, that was a quick release. Dang it. <laughs> That was fun. But there's a bunch of chunk rock right here. There's got to be more down there. This was one cool little creek to just keep following. I didn't even end up fishing that aqua duck. I just kept following the little creek that went under it and just kept having little pools with little fish here and there and all the rocks and just tossing in there. Of course, we're in the middle of the city, so there's a lot of trash and it doesn't look that awesome. but. It was almost like hiking through the jungle into those little pools and still pulling out some bass and bluegill and stuff. But right here was the cool spot where it meets the river. This flowing water into the river, it's a little muddy right here right now, but those fish could see just well enough. And we were catching some Guadalupe bass right here, which cool little fact, they're only to parts of Texas and they almost look like smallmouth and fight like smallmouth. And the smallmouth that are here in the rivers in Texas actually breed with them. So they make like Guadalupe smallmouth hybrids. Cool little facts. But anyways, maybe I'll come back down here and fish for some of these with a kayak or something out here on the river. But I love fishing these little creeks. Let me know if you guys love fishing little creeks like I do because there's so many cool things to go explore and see where the fish are actually hiding and what you can catch them on. But thanks for watching you guys and subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video if you liked it and I'll see you guys in the next one.